Hi, and welcome back to Still Hopes in 5. It is Monday, October the 5th, and I am Stephanie Parker, Still Hopes Director of Public Relations. Once again, I apologize if you hear some construction noise in the background. It doesn't seem to matter how early in the morning you film, those construction guys are still working, which I guess is good because it's keeping everything on track, but I did want to mention that. We do have a handful of things happening on the Still Hopes campus this week, so I'm just going to dive right in right now. Starting with today and tomorrow, we will have flu vaccines in the Keenan Event Center. This is for Still Hope's residents. On Monday, the flu vaccines will be given from 1230 until 330. And then on Tuesday, they will be given from 930 until 1230. Wednesday will also be used for flu vaccines if that is needed. You should have already been contacted by either Tacey Goheen or Kirsten Fahler. If you have not, please get in touch with either one of those so that you can schedule an appointment if you would like to get your flu vaccine. So again, that will be taking place on Monday, October the 5th from 12.30 until 3.30 and then Tuesday, October the 6th from 9.30 until 12.30 in the Keenan Event Center. Then looking towards the end of the week on Thursday, October the 8th from 3 until 5 in the Keenan Event Center and the Atrium, we will be holding our third annual Resident Art Show Gala. Um, if you are interested in more details, please see a member of the Art Committee. Again, that will be on Thursday, October the 8th from 3 until 5 in the Keenan Event Center and the Atrium. Then looking to Friday, which is October the 9th, we will be holding our annual blood drive in the Keenan Events Center. This will take place from 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. You can see the front page of connections for registration information or call 803-995-8131. Lastly, on Sunday, October the 11th, we will have another day of in-person chapel services. I know many of you are very happy to see those return, as are we. So there will be two services on Sunday. One will be at 930 and one will be at 11. Of course, we have to limit the amount of folks that are in the chapel for each service. So if you would like to attend either of those services, please sign up in the chapel book that is located in the library. And that's going to be all for today's episode. Thank you so much for joining me and I look forward to seeing you right back here next week.